guys what's going on today we're going to be eating swiss food it's gonna be cheesy are you ready let's go in cheesy goodness so you're supposed to eat fondue and raclette with the white wine very light. And this is the soup here. It's a rye soup. It's got some cheese on top. This looks very rich. It's got a very creamy, cheesy smell to it. Very thick, very creamy. Looks hot. Mmm. Tasting uh, vegetables. Vegetables and cheese. Very creamy. Um, there's also mushrooms in here. Mm. The soup itself, though, is, is fairly bland. Add a bit of pepper. Maybe you just push it. And give it a bit of kick. Mm. Much better. The base is... I can't really tell what it is. It's kind of like a rice. Mm. Not rice. Wow. Interesting. That's the rye right here. It's kind of gooey. Almost potato-like. Yeah, it's right. Very fresh. Mm. That's it. And that is it. Yum. The fondue has arrived, and there were several different choices for the flavors for fondue. So I chose the basil, basil fondue. It's the bread and some meat, and vegetables. Let's so get it while it's hot. Start with some healthy salad, broccoli here. Oh yeah, the broccoli. Not much of a smell. Shrimp fondue. Oh boy, this is the first. Shrimp fondue. Mm. The cheese is very light. Not as thick as it looks. Sausage. Go for this in one bite. Mmm. Goes good with the meat. Carrot? It's definitely fun eating, for sure. And the bread. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Juggling balls. Pickled vegetables. The potatoes. So this cheese here is French cheese, actually. Oh boy, look at that. Oh. Mm. Wow. First time eating raclette. Cheesy. I like the thickness. This could go on a pizza. Fondue is much more sort of watery. But this is the real deal. Mm. So good. Full of flavor. Pickle. Mm. Yummy. I better save some cheese for the uh, potatoes. Very messy. There's a prime bit of this. Pepper. Wow. Delicious. Swiss cheese. Okay, here we go. Round two. This is Swiss cheese. Where's the holes in it? Okay. Oh boy, get that. Swiss rock oh, It smells so good. 
This one's a bit creamier. Wow. Mm. Hey, so what do we have here? This is uh, like a beef stew in a, uh, a tomato sauce. And then this is corn here. Corn. Interesting. Not potato. We've already done the potato course. Mmm. It's like cornmeal. Yeah. So it's got like a cornbread, cornmeal taste for sure. Mmm. Interesting. The beef could probably do this in one bite. We'll do it in two bites. Oh. Wow. That is really soft. Really juicy. Oh, very nice. Good dish. <laughs> this one is called Geschelzka, and it's a, uh, a beef potato based dish. Mm -hmm. Big serving fork and spoon here. Geschelzka, that's my pronunciation. <laughs> It's like a very rich hash brown. I like it very oily. Rich indeed. Mmm. I like the meat too. Very flavorful. Yeah. Mmm. Nice good eats right there. <coughs> espresso. Gotta go European. This is the two types of espresso. This is the stronger one. It's rated 8 out of a 10 for uh, yes, uh, darkness of the roast. Mmm, it's pretty bitter. Wow, what do we have here? A biscuit. Sweet. It's got a fruit filling. Alright, so now it's time to rate this meal. Swiss food, wow. First time for me ever. I've had fondue before, but uh, raclette. That thing was amazing. Yeah, I love how they just scrape that cheese out of the, the big, the big thing. And, uh, tastes very much sort of like pizza to me, actually. You know, when you're putting it with the potato. Uh -huh. This food is very rich. I can definitely feel it like sitting in my stomach already. So definitely the kind of food where you can put on some weight very easily. And, but delicious at the same time. So out of my rating system. I'm gonna give it a total of five out of six stars. Five out of six, it's a nom nom. So, pretty good stuff. I enjoyed it. Makes me wanna to go to Switzerland sometime. Yeah, definitely give it a try. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and we'll see you next time, next week. Oops, didn't realize that this is gonna be served with ice cream as well too. So you see this is a set menu, it's a lunch set menu. And the price for this, it's about $30 per person. And then there was one other dish that I ordered on the side. That last one, the uh, hash browns and the meat. That was another for like five bucks. Mm, it's very rich. Rich vanilla ice cream. It's got a little bit of honey in it. That's why it's so rich. There's honey in it. Mm. Hey guys, if you'd like to see some of my other videos, check out the screen. You can click on them. And yeah, appreciate you watching. And if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button. See you in the next one.